Now let's move on to the next question. The diagram shows a circle center O and radius 5. Okay, good to know. And the point P lies on the circle. PT is a tangent to the circle. So here we have 90, right? We have to know this property because when we have a tangent and the point here which touches the circle joins with the center, the angle here will have to be 90. Now what else? Uh, the line OT cuts the circle at the point Q. OT, right here Q. Now we also know that OT is also 5 because it is also the radius, right? O, sorry, OQ, not T. Now what else do we need to know? Now part 1, we have to find the perimeter of the region. So step by step, we have to find the perimeter that have to be the distance around the, the region. It is defined by Q, T, P, T, and PQ. So we know the value of PT already, it is 12. Of QT, we don't know yet. Of PQ, we don't know yet. Now PQ is pretty easy. It is what? How can you find this, um, this length? Well, let's see. Um, so what else do we have here? Circle, radius 5. PT is this. Is a tangent this. Okay, so now we have the line cuts this at the line uh, Q at this. Okay, good. Nothing much we have to know here. So we have this and that. So there's a few things we have to do actually here. A uh, pretty interesting question. I mean, not too bad, but kind of interesting. For example, we have to find PQ and we have to find QT. But let's take out the triangle that we can see here. We have this triangle. So we have T here, we have P here, we have O here. This is five, this is 90, and this is 12. Now, to find the, uh, the side PQ, we know it is length of arc, we have to find the angle, this angle, right. Now to find this angle, obviously we can use Sokatoa because it is a right angle triangle. So let's use Sokatoa. That's the first step. Here we have the A side, A side, A side. Here we have the O side, that will be this. So we have tan of the angle that we don't know. That is angle POT is equal to the opposite side, which is um, 12, over A side, which is 5, right? Now we have this equation, so P O T is what? It is simply tan inverse of 12 over 5. That will be in terms of radians, 1.176. This is the angle right here. Now again, uh, how do I know it's radians or degrees? So whatever you work with circular measure for A-level math, please use radians. So to find the length of PQ, pretty easy. We have to use the formula, which is R theta. R is the radius, which is five times the angle. Theta here is 1.176. So answer times five should be 5.88 for the value of PQ. Now what is the value of QT? QT is this part. Now we understand that to find QT, we must first find OT and the minus OQ to get QT, obviously. So to find QT, we must first find OT minus OQ. OQ is a value of 5. Now we have to find OT. Now what is OT? OT can be found by using the Pythagoras theorem. We have this side, this side. It is a right angle triangle, so we can use that. That will be OT square will be 5 square plus 12 square. So OT will be root of 169, let's check. 25 plus 144 will be 169. Root of that will be 30. OT is the value of 30. To replace, you will have 13 minus five will be what? Eight, so the value of QT will be eight. So here we have eight. So add, add, let's see what do we have? Eight plus 12, plus 5.88, that should be 25.9, correct to 3SF. That is part one of the question. Now for part two, we have to find the area of the region. Okay, again, as always, to find the area, we have to break it down to step by step. So the first thing we can do here is what? We can find the area of the whole thing. So number one, 
we can find the area of triangle OPT. Pretty simple. It's half time base and times height because it is a right angle triangle. That will be simplify. That will be 30. Now, second thing, we have to minus the one that we don't want, which is the area of the sector right here. As you guys must know by now, to find the area of sector, we use our formula, which is half r square theta. Half is half, r square is 5 square. Theta is the angle in between, that is 1.176. So half times 25 times 1.176. That'll be 14.7. So finally, to find this one, 30 minus your value should be 15.3. That is your value, correct your 3SF for the area of the shaded region.